All right, so he said, I'm Mitch Strand. Uh, obviously, I have a soccer ball here. We're going to talk about sports for a minute. Uh, everybody knows they're all kind of different. Football does its own thing. Basketball, got you know, shoot the butt, hit and stuff, hit cool. Uh, soccer, play with your feet. If you didn't know that, you can't. It's cool. It's actually called football, but you know, with a U instead of a double O. Um, but uh, all of them, like I said, they kind of deal with it in their own way. Football either like runs or throws the ball. Basketball likes to dribble with their hands and then they shoot it in the bucket. Uh, soccer kicks it, tries to score some goals. Um, but however, whenever the ball goes out of play in all three of these sports, they all kind of deal with it in their own unique little situation. Um, so with football, they just kind of be like, oh, went out of bounds, all right, cool. Let's get back into formation. Let's try another play. So I'm going to throw this to you. Show me how the quarterback throws the ball. It's Real easy. Running. Boom, yeah. Perfect. One hand through the back, forward. All right. You, show me how they pass the ball in basketball. Great. They just kind of shovel it forward. One more. You guys are real good. No, it's perfect. It went straight to my test. Um, but with soccer, it gets a little more technical. Kind of both those sports. It's pretty simple. Like football, you do the formation. Hike, let's go. QB has a ball. Uh, basketball, they just stand on the sideline and just throw it in however they want. It doesn't matter. Soccer, it's a little more difficult. Pretty much the same thing, though. Uh, first rule, though, with uh, soccer throwing is that both feet have to be on the ground the whole time. Uh, you can slide your feet, you can cross them sideways, you can stand like this if you want. Like, it doesn't matter. They both just have to be on the ground whenever you actually throw the ball. Uh, the second part of a soccer throw-in is that you have to have both hands on the ball the whole time. Uh, you can't throw it one-handed. I can't throw it, like, backwards. Uh, you got to have both hands like this. You can put them wherever you want. Like, I can throw it like this. I don't think it's actually going to work, but you can do it if you want. Uh, the last, like, main part is that the ball actually has to go all the way behind your head and then forward. Like, you can't cheat it and just be like, oh, here you go, and just throw it like that. Like, you have to go all the way back and then forward. It actually helps you to do that. You get a lot more power in it, and you can actually throw it farther if you do it right. Um, but, like I said before, a lot of people, they try to do, like, fancy little things with it. Uh, you had him over there earlier trying to do a flip throw. It doesn't really work. Uh, people... Did it work? <laughs> That's what I was trying not to hit the ceiling. Uh -huh. It worked. That's why you threw it on the feet. I can go from the corner all the way like to the other side of the goal box. I don't believe you. Uh, uh, well, but I yeah, basically, <laughs> a lot of people do it. Just the normal thing is, say the line is that cherry. Basically, run up. I'll hold the ball. I'll run up, and I'll just launch the ball like either as hard as I can, or if a dude's right in front of me, I'll just kind of drop it to him. But uh, that's usually the normal premise. A lot of people like to drag their foot behind them. Uh, some people would just stand like straight together and just kind of like lean with it in a sense. Like they just like rock their whole body and throw. Yeah, yeah. lean with a rock with it. Cool. Um, but like others, like kids we taught whenever they were younger kids just to like help get the premise down that you had to have both your feet on the ground otherwise the other team gets to throw it in is we would actually make them cross their feet. So like you're standing like you almost have to do a little potty dance when you're younger. Uh, that's pretty much what we made them do. Uh, it helps a lot. But that's pretty much how you throw a soccer ball uh, whenever it goes out of bounds. All right.